Hey everyone, welcome back to another Element Pack Pro tutorial. In this video, we'll show you how to create a custom header and footer using Element Pack Theme Builder. This powerful tool allows you to design and customize WordPress themes with Elementor. You can create and manage headers, footers, single posts, archive pages, WooCommerce pages, and more. Easily replace your theme's default header and footer with a fully customized design using Elementor's drag and drop interface. Ready to get started? Let's jump in. At first glance, you'll notice that the page doesn't have a header or footer. Our goal is to add both using the Element Pack Pro Theme Builder. To get started, head over to your WordPress dashboard. From there, navigate to the Element Pack Pro tab and click on Theme Builder. Once you're inside the Theme Builder, look at the top left corner of the screen. You'll find an Add New Template button. Click on it, and a pop-up menu will appear, giving you various template options to choose from. In this menu, the first section allows you to select the type of template you want to create. You'll see three options under Post Type, Single, Archive, and Date. Then, under Page Type, you'll find Single, Error 404, and Search. Finally, at the bottom, you'll see theme options for header and footer. Since we're adding a header first, select the header option. Next, give your template a name. For this demonstration, let's name it Navigation. After that, set a condition to define where this header will appear. You'll see three condition options, Entire Site, Singular, and Archive. Since we want to apply this header to a specific page, select Singular. Once you choose Singular, Another field will appear, allowing you to specify which type of singular page should display this header. Select Selective Singular to apply the header to specific pages only. Next, choose the pages where you want to display it. You can select a single page or multiple pages based on your preference. At the bottom, you'll find two final options, active and inactive. If you want your header to be visible on the selected pages, choose active. If you don't want it to be displayed yet, select Inactive. Once everything is set, click on the Create Template button. This will take you to the Elementor Editor, where you can design your header. Before you start designing, make sure to adjust the page layout settings. Once that's done, begin creating your header from scratch. Or, if you already have a pre-designed header, simply paste it in. After making your adjustments, save the changes and return to the original page. Refresh it, and just like that, your new header is now displayed on the selected page. Looks great, right? Now, let's move on to adding a footer. Go back to your WordPress dashboard and once again navigate to the Element Pack Pro tab and then Theme Builder. Click on Add New Template, and when the pop-up menu appears, this time select Footer as the type of template. Just like before, give your footer template a name, set the condition to Singular, choose Selective Singular, and then pick the pages where you want the footer to appear. Finally, make sure the Active option is selected so the footer is immediately visible. Click on Create Template, and you'll be taken to the Elementor Editor. Now, either design a new footer or paste a pre-made footer design if you have one ready. This time, make sure to set Elementor Canvas as the page layout to ensure a clean design without any unnecessary elements. Once you're done, save the changes and go back to the original page. Refresh it, and now you'll see that the footer has been successfully added. That was simple, right? But what if you want your header and footer to appear on every page of your website, not just the home page? Let's do that next. Head back to the Element Pack Pro Theme Builder. Here, you'll see the header and footer templates you just created. Click on the Edit option for the header. When the pop-up menu appears, change the condition type from Singular to Entire Site, and then click Update Template. Now, repeat the same steps for the footer. Click on Edit, change the condition type to Entire Site, and update the template. And that's it. Go back to your website and refresh. Now, check multiple pages, and you'll see that the header and footer have been successfully added to every page of your website. It's that simple and super fast. Now, enjoy designing your website with complete creative freedom. Unlock the power of the Theme Builder and other advanced tools by upgrading to Element Pack Pro today. Thanks for watching. 
If you found this video helpful, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more tutorials. See you in the next one.